in the Spinobot serial number it was assigned to New Scotland Yard three years ago. Perhaps more information about its user or its assignment will be available at the station. So the police were onto the real bombers, but they kept their mouth shut for some reason. Doesn't add up. We don't have all the facts yet. The only way to know for sure is to investigate New Scotland Yard. Christ! Albion's taking this place over like a fucking parasite. And the entire police service. But don't worry, if you're not pleased with your privatised goon squad, just take your business across the street. Didn't think I could feel bad for the English police, but fucking hell. Not to worry, the only difference now is the uniform, assault weapons, and the fact they're motivated by profit over public service. Now, any record or information on the Spider-Bot will be further in. Opening right there looks like a good exit point. Right, get comfy. This spider might be broken and missing some of its legs, but it can still jump and fit through vents. That's a good way to get through the station undetected. That's a part of the remote detonator system.
that's Dalton's mask. It must have been recovered from Parliament. It might be the only thing left of him now. to jump your way across to get to the next bent opening. your way through this last bent path. Spybot and accessing its internal drives. While I'm analyzing this data, you should make yourself scarce, unless you'd like to explain to your new, heavily armed, privatized police force why you've broken into the station. Fine. satellite-based GPS module that regularly pushed its location to a specific ground station. A secret location? None of this makes sense. We better go check it out. Pushing you the ground station's coordinates. 